Hello everyone and welcome to episode 15 of Mickey's Musings and Readings. Um, so here is the little traveler or <laughs> um, that I told you about in the last two videos or, uh, or um, I told you in the it was episode 13 I think that he uh, he went uh, on holiday without selling me and then in the last video I told you how happy I was that he he is back so since then we are reunited and we are really enjoying each other's company and at the moment we're sitting in the garden and uh, that's his favorite place to be so today what I thought um, I would share with you is a little bit uh, about my world, my real world. Now you will understand what I mean by my real world. Um, I often write about my real world in my art journals. This is one of my, my art journals and, um, and I also draw pictures about my real world. So this is what I want to share with you today. So I'll um, put up a picture of the painting I did. Uh, there, there is, but I'll, I'll, um, I'll show it to you um, as a photo uh, in this video. And so let me, uh, let me read to you what I wrote on this day. I can't remember when I created this. It, might, it was a few years ago already but my world is always like what I describe in this text. In my world, polka dot hearts hang from the clouds, a beautiful reminder that love is everywhere all the time, available for all in quantities to your heart's content. In my world, being a hopeless romantic is normal, Playing slow romantic melodies on my flute is highly appreciated here. Flowers in magnificent shapes and colors can talk. Rich and colorful conversations, laughter, sharing wonderful stories are everyday happenings. And sometimes the butterflies chip in too and do they have stories to tell. Often, beautiful, transparent, shiny, bluish soap bubbles rain from the sky. And how much lightness of being that brings to the day. There are fountains everywhere and drinking the crystal clear sweet water has an extraordinary, sensational, toxicating effect. A kind of feeling immense happiness for no particular reason at all. And one can't help but lay down on the cool, soft green grass, looking up and once again feeling amazed at the vastness of the sky and feeling so grateful to it be experiencing all of this. I hope you enjoyed this little fantasy of mine. <laughs> And um, I will see you next week for another episode of Mickey's Musings and Readings. Take care of yourself. Bye for now.